think I'm aware naman, yes. I'm aware with the projects of the Student Council this year. Um, first, yung recent project fight. Meron din Retrovail. Meron yung sa buwan ng wika. I forgot what the name of the event is. Tapos, marami pa naman silang ina-endorse yan. Sports Fest, D-Ship, everything yun. Yes, I'm aware of some of that. I'm aware of the Student Council's projects. Actually, it's because the student council will able to actually uh, to like post their projects in their social media sites, and hence I'm actually aware with these projects such as Project Fight, like that. Uh, I am quite aware of the student council's project this year. So I was aware of the uh, projects that they held, which is the Retro V. Uh, one more is the Project Fight, as well as. Uh, Yunoya, which they recently just had. Yes, um, I've seen them um, social media posts on Facebook. Pa. Yeah, ano di ba yun yung sa prom and stuff like yung mga pinapagawa nila. Tapos yung mga daily announcements nila. Tapos yung they implement the ano tawag don. Yung they always keep us informed. Yung student body, di ba yun yung mga projects? Yeah, so far. As far as I've noticed, they were able to carry out the, the promises that they've made, such as the one by the ABM representative, Isa, wherein she promised to have this strand reviewer, and then it really happened during the month. Uh, from what I remember, kasi, during the campaign last year, uh, the, but Tiffany Chua, the president, made like a promise last year, na, like, for example, Ted, like, that there's gonna be a TED talk that's gonna be, that's gonna happen here, gonna, and I'm happy to know na na yun nga na may collaboration yung sa senior high and TED talk na upcoming ayon so yeah. Siguro for me oh oh naman siguro kasi since wala na mga issue sa senior high. I think naman na they fulfilled what they promised to the students since di ba. As a student leader, diba, you promise na you have those certain advocacies, campaigns, or like projects. And I think naman, kaya naman nila and na fulfill naman la. And some of the plans, like, ano naman, like in progress naman show. So not necessarily na hindi naman siya natutupad. So I think naman na the student council was able to carry out their promises as students. Um, I believe so, yes, but some of the promises, um, such as change of schedules, maybe that's a, one of the problems, but I think some of it is not in your control, so I kind of understand the change of schedules. But um, for that, I think I would say that I think you should tell us before the change, like earlier uh, for the change of schedule. As far as I can see, yes. Natutupad naman, especially si Brio, kasi, ano, tawag doon, I was, ano, sumama ako doon sa isang meeting nila kasi wala yung mga officers namin. So, nakita ko naman kung gano'n sila ka-organize, mag-handle ng mga gano'n. Uh, I could say that this year's roster of student council officers are definitely hardworking and effective since uh, the projects that they've made are, um, have effectively been implemented. Okay. okay, so going back to the campaign, uh, yung mga officers sa Tabakbo, I really admire them. Parang, parang they're really effective on delivering their speeches, delivering their promises. But when pagdating nung like actual work na, uh, I feel like mas nagmark yung performance sa akin ng president this year more than the other officers. Uh, I'm not really familiar with most of them, and I don't personally know them yet, so maybe I really can't say. But in general, um, I think they're doing pretty, pretty well the one since their platforms are being implemented and they're doing a lot of projects that are effective the one. But hopefully we, we get to know most of them by the future. I think they're very capable and hardworking. They're also very outgoing, and I can really see that 
uh, especially in their campaigns and their uh, the events that they have made and held. I think ano mag maganda sila kasi mas feel ko yung presence nila kaysa sa ano past experiences ko about the student council from my different schools. I'm satisfied naman with their performance since as I've said earlier they're really like working hard to try their best to implement their um, platforms and they're really making the effort to try and Yes, but I think they have to work on more with BE to getting their presence known. Pa, because like, like there are events, there are talks na hindi alam ng lahat, and then there are projects na hindi rin aware yung lahat na ame gantaren para. Seeing the success of the student council's projects, such as the project fight, well, I could say that I'm actually really satisfied with the. Uh, projects of and the performance of the student council. Um, I'm pretty satisfied in my opinion because like as what I've said earlier kanina, parang they have many projects and there will be many projects soon. Tas ngayon pa na, nakita natin sa social media yung TEDx Youth X TEDx Youth di ba? Tapos yung kasa partner with the De La Salle Senior High School. So like parang ano Parang yung performance wise nila parang ay andun na. Parang yung sa mga batch reps parang they're really really able to communicate with the strands na hina-handle nila and also the executive officers parang may kanya-kanya silang duties but at the same time they handle it well naman. So yun. Uh, I'm quite satisfied with the student council council's performance uh, since they have actually made my my stay in La Salle uh, quite enjoyable and entertaining. So I was able to experience a lot already with all of the campaigns, with all of the programs and events that they've done. To be honest, they are doing okay. They're not doing um, like the highest, but I believe they're doing okay. Sapat na po yung ginagawa nila. And why I believe that is they follow their plans. Uh, accordingly, and they do keep their promises yeah, as once. Yeah, I know, satisfied. Ako. Nakikita ko naman yung ginagawa nila, and especially Star Retro Week, na push through nila yung event na yun. I think the council should like work more on being more of a visionary, kasi, kasi when you see and plan things beforehand, it helps the group to gauge both the negative and positive possibilities. I do think that they should improve on the dissemination of information and communication. Siguro dun sa pag... papapansin, hindi naman sa pagpapapansin, Para, parang ganun na sa senior high. Kasi hindi namin sila masyadong ramdam. I think they should continue improving on connecting with the student body so that uh, there, th there will be uh, more unity within uh, the student body and they, they'd be able to cooperate more with not only the presidents and not only the officers but to the whole uh, batch itself. I think they should improve on communication with the students themselves. Or at least improve with the parents' communication. For me, uh, I'm really having difficulties adjusting to senior high and stuff. So I really want something that, like a project that will help students like academically, for, uh, uh, so we can also help each other. Mainly communication and dissemination of information, since not. I think not everyone in the senior high school student body is aware also of the projects that the student council was able to develop. 
uh, siguro yung sense of being felt as a group. Um, di ba sinabi ko kanina, like, more engagement sa students. So, why not they sh- prioritize, like, more activities that will enable the students to interact. Inter- basta more interactive, like, not just, like, yung mga talk, ganyan, ganyan. Like, effective naman yung talk kasi may, may natututunan, seminars, ganyan. Pero, like, interactive, like, mga game siguro or something. Like, more on, ano, like, um, yung mga kapag-communicate din yung students sa isa't isa. Parang, yun naman kasi yung, sa dami ba naman ng senior high school students. So, parang, would you think na parang, di ba, why not have the possibility na makilala yung iba, di ba? Uh, I think, as I have said before, I think the aspect that they should continue working on is connecting the bonds of the students because that's what re- that's what's really important in for me in my stay in La Salle, is the memories and the experiences. Um, maybe they should prioritize on the students' well-being because uh, I believe that. Um, some students here have problems with their academics or some in their personal life. And um, I know it's none of the student council's business to go into their lives, but if they're trying to reach out, I think the student council should lend a hand with the um, students that are troubled. Um, siguro, ano, responsibility-wise, saludo ko dyan. Siguro kung ako yung Elsie, parang feel ko naman di ko kakayaan. Dami nilang ginagawa. Tapos, sa expectations ko, siguro, kasi parang ev- lahat naman ng tao may expectations sa mga student council. Kasi nga, sila yung na-elect as leaders. And as leaders, kailangan nila mag-serve sa students. And I think naman nagaganapanan nila yon na mag-serve sa students. Tapos, parang naano nga nila yung mga announcement sa admin, ganyan. So, parang in that way, parang nakaka-engage yung SC with the students. No. Kasi, as in, wala talaga, wala, hindi ko sila random, hindi ko sila nakikita sa paligid. Like, pag may event lang, doon lang sila mag, doon ko lang sila nararamdaman, as in, doon ko lang sila nakikita. Doon lang sila parang, hindi ko sure kung doon lang sila gumagawa ng action or hindi na hindi nila pinapakita sa senior high, pero yun lang, yun yung napapansin ko. I don't have expectations kasi, I think, yun nga, they're impact is not high enough for me yet to have my own expectations on them. Yung, uh, to be honest, yung concerts talaga, um, they were carefully planned and perfectly planned talaga. Um, especially with Retro Vipo. Um, that was basically one of my best nights here in Terrasa. Sa execution. <laughs> like, dun lang talaga nag yung pag ano pagtanga ko sa student cast ngayon kasi they're more visible talaga well actually i would just commend them for their job since i know that being a student council officer is really difficult it's really challenging and tiring therefore i would commend them on their job and hope and i would tell them that hopefully they will be able to keep up with their performance unite siguro umpisa nila sa 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 group nila kasi parang hindi na hindi nila kami kumbaga hindi kami nasasama doon sa gusto nilang mangyari parang for for them lang to the SC siguro hello <laughs> um you're doing great guys parang keep up the good work continue to strive harder for the betterment of the students and also the Lasallian community parang Um, siguro, ano, as what other orgs or like other councils, parang keep on improving. Kaya nyo naman yan and all the Lasallian students believe in you naman. Words of encouragement lang that I admire their hard work and uh, although, syempre, there are, there are mga pagkukulang <laughs> but it's okay to not be able to deliver those kasi parang it's parang it's essential naman to always have a room for improvement. Uh, I would tell them that they did a great job and they should continue doing your, their best and continue serving uh, the student body since I know right now it's 
quite challenging to balance your academics with uh, being a leader, especially uh, in a high caliber, uh, such as leading those, uh, since leading a lot of people in the environment. I would tell them that keep doing your job, but always try to improve your way of communication as, you know, some people here may not have social media at all or they don't have access, yeah, they don't have access to social media at all or they don't even look at their Facebook or they even use a different medium other than Facebook, Twitter, or Instagram. And they should also improve on the parents' communication as maybe parents are more controlling or more decisive than their students. I really don't know them individually, but I'm familiar with them as a whole. Hindi. Hindi ko sila ramdam talaga. As I question, as I answered the previous questions, ayon ngayong medyo ko lang na presence. I think effective naman. Like, mararamdaman mo talaga sila on and off like social media. Pag nandito sila, pag may events, talaga makikita mo na todo asikaso sila together with the two home. So, sa social media naman, di ba? Lahat naman tayo nakikita yung mga ginagawa nila sa social media. So, tapos yung mga like yung mga projects pa nila, di ba? Parang um mararamdaman mo talaga yung ngayon nga, di ba, yung sa TED like, TED Youth ba 'yon? Tapos sa tapos yung mga ayan, yung ABM Bazaar pa, di ba? Tapos parang parang pinapakalat agad nila sa ABM Bazaar bilang help kasi as an ABM student, di ba? Parang the bazaar, medyo mahirap magbenta and like with the help of the student council, natutulungan nila kami na parang ma-promote yung product, yung company namin, ganyan. And also yung yung project fight nga na yan, parang as in naramdaman mo, di ba, nakapag-collaborate sila with the JP. Tapos parang mararamdaman mo na, di ba, nagkaroon sila ito, yung button pins, ganyan, fundraising, senior high school shirts, ganyan. Parang the projects that they implement, parang they make sure na mararamdaman yung presence and yung effectiveness ng plan nila. E, yes, um, I've seen multiple projects made by the student council and um, so far they are very good. You know, they're making their presence really felt here in De La Salle University. Yes, kasi hindi naman no pala social media na tao. Like, hindi ako nag-account sa Facebook that much. Pero na-inform pa rin ako. Definitely, yes. Uh, yes. Uh, yes. Napapakita naman nila. Siguro, ano lang. Kulang. Yes, like I said earlier, the project fight. Um, it was a really well-thought project and it was also well-implemented, like I said. We were all very Yes, because I know that man up when you plan like projects and everything. As a Rosalian, dapat natural na sa atin yun na 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 mamanifest natin yung mga Rosalian values. Yeah, effective naman siya sa iba yung ibang project nila. Um, I think naman it's effective, but I think na some needs improvement. Like, hindi naman sa kailangan talaga ng ano, like, alam mo yun na parang pag nakita mo yung project, parang may isip mo na may, may, mas igaganda pa to. Pero I'm not saying na hindi sila maganda or effective. It's just that it could be something more. Yes. Kasi marami namang sumusunod. Like, even the evaluation of the SE members, marami namang sumasigod as ano sa nakikita ko. Yes, I know their goal naman is uh, their goal and their goal and their purpose naman for their projects are good. I would say they're, yeah, they are effective but I think more suggestions could be taken. <laughs>